Right, hi everyone and welcome back to all my 78s. Now, late night listings might have to stop a little bit because, um, uh, well, they've already stopped, didn't they, for a while? I mean, let's be honest. But I mean, I mean, my ideas of wanting to restart them again because it's, it's too hot. It's too hot at the moment to sit in the shed with the door closed because obviously I can't disturb the neighbours late at night playing records and chatting away to myself. Uh, <laughs> well, I'm chatting to you, but, you know, for all intents and purposes, I'm chatting to myself. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so I'm going to wait until the weather, uh, the, the, the good old, um, you know, autumn and, and, and winter comes in where it's a lot more um, 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 practical to do it with the door closed. Yes. The door's closed now at the moment. Uh, I don't know why, but it's been a bit noisy out there. Right. <laughs> so no, it's not a new hat. Well, it is a new hat. It's a hat that I wore when I was on holiday in Italy. I, I was in Italy for a week uh, at Sorrento. And um, yeah, yeah, I was. And uh, and uh, it's a hat I bought while I was over there. And it's got hole. It's got holes in it. It's got, it's got like a mesh so the air can get through more. So the other one, the other hat's a bit... Uh, and this is a bit more cooling. Why am I wearing a hat? I don't know. I just got used to wearing a hat, especially when I talk to you guys. Right. So what are we going to talk about quick today? Uh, I found this. Woohoo. It's great. It's a an original um, uh, Brunswick release. Um, and though it's got two different bands on it, uh, it's it's a 1931 original release. It's not part of the uh, the the jazz sepia range or or whatever. And that it's uh, I think it's just an original release from 1931, I believe. And somebody can correct me if I'm wrong. Um, and it's uh, King Oliver and his orchestra. Stop crying on on uh, on one side on and uh, on the B side. On the A side, it's the Jungle Band, Duke Ellington, and uh, Rocking in Rhythm. I quite, I quite, quite pleased to see King Oliver actually. So I, I liked uh, King Oliver, and his, his, his stuff is really, really cool. And I thought, well, I would like to play this, but it is a little bit beaten up. It is a little bit beaten up. There is a little, there is, there is a little bit of a chip. Mm, it's a tiny, there's a tiny chip in the play. Uh, so there's a couple of little minor chips on the outer rim there, or oh, the uh, the dead wax, you know, the uh, the the beginning bit. What do you call it again? The um, that's nice. Shouldn't do that, really. Should I? <laughs> in case I break it, it's a thick, heavy one. So uh, it's well, say it's thicker and heavier than than some of the other ones are of the of the Brunswick era, because this is an early one. Well, I say no, it's not an early one, but it's it's a, it's a, it's a, well, it's earlier than some of the other side I've got. I, I should just get on and tell you what I'm going to do, shouldn't I? And stop chatting. Gonna put this on here and play it because I can, I'm not going to play this on the record deck because I don't want to wreck my stylus. Uh, especially when it hits that chippy bit there. Um, whereas this can cope with it a lot better and it will sound a lot better also on this as well. As I say, it is quite worn in in areas. So and I've, I've got, a, uh, I've not got many, but I've got a few trailing needles and I'm going to put that on it and see if that helps uh, also to uh, give a better, better play. So, so <laughs> let's listen to this stop i've not heard it before really i've heard bits of it but i haven't heard the whole thing stop crying by king creole and his orchestra right
so good and I didn't realize I had a vocal in it I didn't know it was going to be scatting in it as well that is fantastic what a find that is for me I didn't know it was so good I haven't played the other side yet we'll play the other side on another video uh, which will be the jungle band rocking in rhythm which is the a side this was the b side stop crying King Oliver and his orchestra an original first issue in this in the UK I believe I'm very happy with that. Cheers. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I have re-recorded. Although you've seen this, me and this plane, I have re-recorded this with uh, my my technique to help and en enhance the sound a bit more. Um, not using any any computerised stuff. Just using a microphone um, balanced in the, in in the horn and and just balanced. I might do a video on that. I think I did mention it once before, but I might do a video of that in the future. Anyway, yeah, there was a bit of a in the middle bit where it hit that little chip. It's a little chip, but each 78 is uh, is, uh, is is individual, isn't they? They've all got their little problems. Some of them are nice and shiny, as we know, and they have no problems. Some of them are like this. That's been well played, well worn, well played, but it's been well loved as well. And it's made it all through the years, from 1931 right up to now it's nearly it's getting on but it won't be that it's not what's it 90 90 years old 91 two years old that's not bad going is it eh? i'll tell you what if you look as good as that when you're 92 you won't be able to complain will you hey eh? oh it's blinking hot in here right I'll catch you later <laughs> thanks for watching this and uh, i'll be back soon bye for now <laughs>